Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Randomized. Um, if you're wondering why I'm on the title screen, it's um, basically, as you've probably seen just before this, I might include it just before, or maybe I will include it after this little speech, I don't know just yet. Um, I recorded like a bunch of the game, like specifically sort of up to, it was like up through the next dungeon, and a little bit beyond that and apparently none of it saved um well it saved but it just didn't have audio and i was like freaking out and then i realized that i saved at some location so i don't know exactly where this is um if it's like after where i got to then i'm kind of screwed <laughs> um i'll just put in like a montage or like a quick overview of what we did um, but otherwise, um, I'm just going to pick up where we are, so I'm, I'll know some of the things which are coming up ahead, um, like, I know who Azelf is already, um, I mean, that, that we find, that we found that out, so I can't actually remember if it was in the last one, but then again, it's like, I pretty much have recorded four episodes and they all just went to heck, so, alright, just to save time, I'm going to jump straight in, and... Yeah, like I said, I'll probably put in a montage just before this speech, um, just so you can know what happened, but just thought I would explain. <laughs> oh, it's just a trap to 12, okay, piracy is no party. Oh dear. So I think, yeah, this is just before, so actually, um, this isn't the end of the world, because um, I'm pretty sure this is just after we um, did like the Red Plan story, so we just basically lost a bunch of the story. Um... I'm probably going to fast forward this, because if I remember, there is an awful lot of story. Um, and again, like I said before, I'm not going to be doing like all the stories, and this is like super early in the morning for me. I do not have the energy to be going through it. But yeah, Azelf got randomised to a gold bat, of all things. Um, which is like, it's super, super duper fun. <laughs> the idea of like, the three late guardians, a gold bat, a cast form, and um, a shiggy or squirtle. But yeah, I am sad that I lost all the data, because there was some good highlights in it. Like me surviving like three monster houses back to back. I don't know if that'll happen again. But yeah, as you can see here, um, <laughs> well, I can't this threatening gold bat. No, you can't take it, never. But yeah, basically, I want to try and at least get through the dungeon today. Maybe, I wonder if this means the items in the shop get re-randomised, because that was another thing as well. There was one where I got like four time, not four time gears, four reviver seeds. They might as well be time gears at this point. Um, but I got four reviver seeds just in like one shop, and I was like, well, there goes my life savings. <laughs> All on reviver seeds. The strategy never fails. Okay, off we go to the ordinary roost. Oh yeah, and the guildmaster's asleep. I think I even skipped through this in the beginning. Well, in the original. But yeah, literally there was a whole episode where I was just doing that as voices. Because, like, it, it was so long. And, like, even in the actual dungeon itself. <gasps> no, I just realised. I, I think I lose the dust school. Oh, no. Oh my god, that's so sad. Okay, I'm really hoping I get a dust school again. Maybe I'll still do it for the thumbnail anyway. Um... Uh, okay, so I have no money, but I think I have to sell stuff if it is the same items. Um, oh no, it is different items. Um, there's a scope lens, and I kind of would like to sell some stuff just so I have one as a backup. Um, I'll sell that. Um, Cacnea Spike. Lost Loot. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure this is the one where I had like four of things. Um, don't need that, don't need that, I don't even need Defog. Oh yeah, because Golden Seed was five, and I found like three of them while venturing through the next dungeon. It was like insane. Oh, so mad, I'm still so mad that I lost it all. Yes, um, bye, give me that scope lens and I'll put it. Oh, they changed? I'm not just imagining that, am I? But they changed. Because this is definitely what they had before. Huh. Uh, kept the honorary stops while I was talking to him, I guess. Right, so, 
Uh, I want to put in this, 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 keep those. Actually, no, I want to put in that. Uh, I wonder that if the dungeon layouts are going to be like exactly the same. In that case, it's going to be a test of like how good my memory is. Um, Stone Age, Ice Beam, you guys can go in, Trap Burst, or... Oh yeah, because that was another thing. There was one dungeon where I did like all the monster houses in a row, and then I was on like 10 HP and I took one step, and I died. Because <laughs> of a fucking spike fall trap. <laughs> oh my god, right, let's store all our money. Okay, so... If it is all the same, this gold ticket last time we did it, well, I say we, but I did it. Um, we got, da -da -da, I think it was ye yellow we picked. So let's go with red and see what happens. Is it a win? Is it not? So is it a win or is it not? <gasps> Don't tell me, is it a big win? Oh my god, we need to see the Milo Egg again! <laughs> So, I'm guessing it is predetermined. I did not realise that. Because last time I picked yellow and I got like the intermediate prize. Oh my god, this still this still is so funny to me. I think it's probably because I have friends who really like Milo Ick, but and then it's just like everyone's memory is erased. So let's see what item we got. A false swipe. Uh okay, that kind of wasn't worth it. So yeah, there, there you go guys, uh, if you did not know, apparently you can reset that and keep trying. But yeah, off we go to Ordinary Roost. So hopefully I get to the end of the dungeon today, well in this episode. Last time it took me like an episode and a half. But the main thing I want to get is the Dust Ghoul. I will explain it if we do come across the Dust Ghoul. But, oh my god, it was such a good mon. Like... It was such an MVP in a lot of ways, despite how shitty it seems at like first glance. Sneak scarf. That reminds me. Uh, I will give you the detect band. I will take scope lens. Okay, you d you do that, Rayquaza. Um, Royal gummy. You can eat that. I don't think we learned any IQs in the last one. Um, we saved that for whenever Rayquaza levels up next. Um, I'll give that to Rayquaza just in case he does. Yeah. Oh, he did get a new one. Aggressor. But um, so far this doesn't seem like the same layout. Oh, hello Ditto. You were not... Uh, you might have been in the dungeon last time. That to me seems like an obvious monster house, so I'm not going in there. I guess it is still randomised then. Oh. <gasps> I will take baby me, thank you, thank you, uh, you can definitely come along, I love how it had to walk as well, despite going on it, the water itself before, oh my god, mobile scarf, wait isn't that the one where it lets you walk anywhere, I think that is, yeah, oh that might be good, that might be really good. Now part of me wants to say it's up, but it's not. Yeah, so it is definitely randomised. I did not mean to do that, I thought it was Aerial Ace. That's Aerial Ace though. So we've actually avoided a good chunk of the monster houses so far. I think there's only one which is like, you have to do because you get spawned in the room. Uh, excuse me. How dare you do that to Ray Ray? Oh god, that would have been a monster house if I had ever seen one. Return, I think that's good. Mossy Rock, that's the Leafeon. Yeah, I feel like the Pokemon even got re-randomised. Like, these aren't the same Pokemon that I was seeing before. Before it was like Shuppets and Duskulls. Uh, thank you, Rayquaza, for not stepping on it. I'm just gonna heal up. Yeah, Skitty was in here last time, so maybe it hasn't. But yeah, so basically, um, the main reason... Oh no, this is the monster house. <laughs> no, I thought that was freaking vacuum cut. Yeah, so here's the dust school. Now, this dust school is both a blessing and a curse. Um, 
So, the Duskulls in this game have Truant, which sounds awful to begin with, right? However, um, that is not the actual case. Um, they have Ominous Wind, so if they get the boost, which more likely than not is, like, gonna happen, um, their speed doubles, so they can take two moves every action. And, um, if you haven't figured it out exactly, basically what that means is they take an action, and then sure they waste one because of Truant, but then they're allowed to take another one again, so it's like, the ability is, like, nullified. Oh god. Well, which I know isn't, like, obviously ideal. What did you just use? Sa you have Sand Veil. Moves. San Seed Flare. Oh, boy. Uh, you, you could actually come in handy to the final boss, and like who we had last time. Well, we had a Paris who didn't even know any Grass-type moves. <laughs> and I picked them up thinking that, oh, well, Paris is a Grass-type. You'll really help against Relicamp. That was a wiggly tough. I did not realise. Uh, I don't think there's that many on this dungeon. I want to say it was like 10, maybe? Oh, Powder wants to join the team. Uh, I'm okay with sending you home, because I'd rather have C-Player Sandshrew for all it's worth. Just because if it does survive, um, I could obviously just absolutely wreck the Relic Camp. Yeah, we'll take you, but you need to go home. I think I've already got a Sol Rock, actually. Uh, you have nothing good, and even then, I don't have any money, and I'm not about to steal, because stealing is wrong, kids. Do not steal from Kecleon. Uh, that's how I learned that stealing was wrong as a child. Oh, God. But no matter how fast you are, you can't live a plus three Bomerang. Oh my god. Why are they all wanting to join suddenly? Wait, is it because I have Sentry with me and Sentry is just like that attractive? Okay, so it requires a leveled up here, so we can now give it the Golden Seed. I feel like I'm feeding it the Golden Child. <laughs> um, golden Seed. So yeah, this item is busted. And to think we found like three of them before. 41, 42, 43, 44. Oh yeah, I think as well, I think I get my next move at level 45, because that was another thing which happened, and I tried to learn Bubble. Um, I can't think of an instance where I really wanted Bubble, so I didn't learn it, uh, but if anyone wants to tell me otherwise, um, maybe I can always go back and relearn it. I mean, I have the chance to pick it up again, but like, I really do like my current moveset. Um, oh god, I am tired. I sh I've not been up this early in a long time. <laughs> But it's what happens when you start a new job tomorrow. Although, by the time you're seeing this, um, I will have already started the job. Okay, Sancho, I need you to take care of this. Thank you. Oh god, am I getting hungry? Oh, and that was another thing. I had Reviver Seeds on, like, the final floor, and I used, like, three of them <laughs> on my way to the final boss. Right. No, that's not it. Maybe it's 15. Oh god, it's Lediba. I can't even... Okay. Down you go. But yeah, you guys will probably... I think this one will go up on Wednesday. Maybe... Don't die from hunger, Kai. You could make this. You just have to find the bloody room. Payback. Oh yeah, these things have colour change, I believe. But yeah, it'll probably be Wednesday, because I believe... Or well, obviously, if I don't count the ones I have right now, um, which didn't work for whatever reason. Oh, new move. Hidden power. Uh, get rid of Santu, why not? But yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure it will be... Um, it'll be Wednesday. If not, maybe Thursday. God, I, I can't even remember how much I've already pre-recorded that now because of this hiccup. Oh my god. Please let it be. You had Spike Cannon. Well, I guess I wasted a Reviver Seed. 
I didn't know the milk tanks spike can. I knew they had color change. Hello, sun ribbon. Uh, I thought you were a golden ribbon, so I was more excited. Hello, Drapion. This is going to be the final floor, I think. Maybe. Yeah, told you. But what are the chances? Is this the deepest part of the cavern? Hey, Kai, over here. Look at these crystals. They're huge. They're in different colours, too. Clearly, they stand out on their own. But on the way here, we didn't see anything out of the ordinary. Yeah, so last time I got here, I had a dust score on my team, and it was actually really nice, because I'd get into a monster house and just ominous wind everything, and then get to, like, plus four speed, and then just spam ominous wind, and nothing could stop it. <laughs> oh, my God. Even at the empty summit was Shiggy. Yeah, fast forward through this. We know what to do here. So... As a kid, this was a really cool thing for me. Like, me and my friend, like, okay, we didn't spend ages trying to figure it out, but um, we didn't realise uh, that blue and purple were different. <laughs> we thought, we tried making it purple and we got so confused, and then we realised it was because Azelf is blue. Which I guess in this case, with Golbat, that actually still works. But yeah, so if you've never played it before, you just have to make all the statues, well, not the statues, the crystals the same colour. But something like this is like what I love in games when you have like little puzzles to advance the plot. There we go. And even this next part is super cool when they fire their lasers. Why a tremor? It's dangerous to cut this back off. Off they go. But yeah, this to me was like amazing. Just having this crystal tower like sprout out of the ground. There's a big jagged opening in the middle. Do you think we should go through here? Maybe that leads to Golbat's Lake. Those the, those three crystals were the key. They opened up a path to lead to a time gear. Let's go. Onward to Golbat's Lake. And speaking of Golbat's Lake, I'm going to leave that for the next one. I, I'm glad we got here in one piece. Um, it's a nice little spoiler of what we've got to look forward to. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, thank you again for watching. Again, I do apologise if it seems a bit rushy, because, again, it's just that I lost everything. Um, I don't know why OBS keeps doing this to me. It keeps recording nothing with sound, and I'm like, it's super, super annoying. I have to keep checking back on everything. But um, as always, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. Um, if you want to follow me on Twitter as well, and Tumblr, um, the at Castaform. Um, I sometimes post on Tumblr, mainly on Twitter these days. Um, you can normally see me there crying about video games. But yeah, until the next one guys, I will see you all later. Bye.